Bees. Wow. I feel a little bit uh, on edge. I mean, they're just doing their work. Mm, a little bit sticky, guys. <laughs> Great place, guys. Yeah, thank, yeah, you. thank you. Yeah. Bees are busy today. They <laughs> are busy, the exactly. What, are they like wanting to come out? Or yeah, so I've locked them up for now, but yep. uh, I've got to release them pretty soon. Release yeah. the bees. And they'll start foraging <laughs> and, and you know, hounds. Yeah, yeah, and start bringing back some pollen and making honey for oh, us. Man. And you guys are saying that you go and rescue bee, bee swarms. Yeah, so the season started, so there's swarms everywhere, and yeah. we collected four yesterday. Um, and yeah, we just rehome them, we'll give them to people. We've got eight in total. Homeless um, bee society. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so guys, we are in your backyard, obviously. Yeah. And down the side behind me here is a pathway that seems to be <laughs> the forgotten pathway. Generally always the way in homes. Yeah. There is that dead side of the house. Now it appears to be quite tidy. What goes on down here? So it's not that tidy. I did do a little bit of a clean up this <laughs> oh, week. Oh, okay. <laughs> but it's, it's just the part that we've neglected for years. We've been here for yeah. four years, and honestly, we haven't done anything with it. Yeah. Um, it's a it's a trademark all around Australia. Everyone's yeah. got the side strip that they never. It's because no one with. can see it. That's that's yeah. that's true. The dead and I, side yeah. of the house. Yeah. <laughs> when the producer showed us the photos of this house, there was a lot more junk there than there was <laughs> yeah. there this morning. Yeah. When we arrived. Charge, yeah. I didn't clean it up. Yeah. Clean it up. Yeah. <laughs> well, look. Obviously, we can't grow plants down there because it's not going to get much sun. Sandwich between brick. Yeah. Have you been bitten or you got a, you got one? You're okay. <laughs> okay. Because they're everywhere. <laughs> um, but I think we can give you a bit of functionality down yeah. there. That'd so, be great. Yeah. Uh, we might let you to release the bees. We might leave and. Oh my we'll goodness. Yep. Yeah. You happy for us to do something? Yeah, sure, sure that'd be great. Thank you. All right. Yes. Let's, Let's do it. Let's do it. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. The most amazing day. Isn't it? Oh my god. Lockdowns are over. It's warm, <laughs> it's sunny, the birds are chirping. We're doing some work in the garden. The bees are out. <laughs> It's like a new life. <laughs> now, well, I think we need to do something for our beautiful homeowners today. They do have that awful side path, but I think, as you've said, a garden probably isn't going to be the right approach. It is dark, but we do need to think about perhaps a functional pathway. It is an access point from front to back. Yeah. The dogs go there, there's bins there, all of that. Yeah, I think you're right. Something that is functional and yeah. the dog's feet stop those from digging. That's yes. going to be a mud bath in winter as well. Could you imagine? So let's have a quick look on the Adbri Masonry website. Yes. Yeah. Uh, they've got some really good pavers. Where are they? Here they are. These are the Euro pavers. I think these were the way to go mm. there. Maybe some pebbles wrapped around it. Yep. Two colour choices. Got Vienna or Prague. Prague. You Definitely reckon? for that space. I think so too. Yep. I think they make a world of difference to those guys. Yeah. Brian, thanks so much for joining us today and giving us a hand with this. Now, I think this is a pretty common occurrence in a lot of households, that dead yep. space beside the house. So what's the plan for today then? Uh, so today we're going to set up a nice step stone pathway down the side of the house. Yep. We're going to use some uh, six, six by four Euro stone pavers yep. Yep. and we're going to lay them in a bed of mortar. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to surround that with some nice pebbles to give it a nice neat finish. Beautiful. And it'll really lift the area up and, yeah. Maintenance free. Did you get our note about the Prague colour? <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Prague's, yeah, because they're the nice ones, aren't Lucky. they? Yeah, they are. Good. Yep. Um, I'm really excited to see what we're going to do for these guys. I think it's going to be fantastic. Yeah. Um, what's the trick? I mean, we know, of course, Danny and I know, but what's the professional trade secret? Uh, to getting that really nice finish. Okay, so you really need to have the area dug down to the right height to start with, yep. and then run your string lines through, mm -hmm. um, and then basically using a, a spirit level and a mallet to tap your pavers down to the height of the string line. In yep. the wet mortar. In the wet mortar, and that, that'll give you a nice, neat finish. Yeah. Beautiful. See, um, I mean, we knew that. Didn't oh, we? totally knew that. <laughs> and then we, you've obviously got to wait for the mortar to set a little bit before you pile the pebbles around. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that Perfect. certainly helps, yes. So, we have gone for this paver here. It's a 600 by 400. Um, it's from Adbri Masonry, and it's the Prague colour, the Euro stone. Now, this is particularly good because it's kind of light, lightly textured, so it gives you an elegant look here, and it actually would look really beautiful beautiful if you had heaps of these around a pool area or even a driveway. Now being from Adbri, it means that they are engineered specifically for a harsh Australian climate. We've kept it really functional for our homeowners today and put these stepping stone pavers in here. So this is an access point from front to back. We've gone with the Prague colour, as Walt said, so it's really dark grey and it's super popular with landscape design at the moment. And then we've contrasted that with these really beautiful quartzy-like pebbles around it. So it's going to be really functional for the guys, very low maintenance and super dog friendly as well. So there we go guys. Oh wow, that oh, wow. looks really good. Fantastic. Really it's a brightens lot up the different, place. isn't it? Oh, yeah, it is. so different. It does so brighten good. it up, doesn't it? Yeah. I think also the contrast in colour, it just 
whole new life there. Perfect for your bin storage and the dogs won't be digging. Yeah, yeah that's a plus. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. yeah, and it just looks like really professional as well. Yeah, I, mean, I do that's sound a, we didn't do it. I sound a little bit surprised. Now, something that's really important to us is using Australian made and Adbri masonry are uh, just that. They've got a great range of pavers, block work, masonry and garden edging as well. So head to the website, adbrimasonry.com.au. There's a bunch of inspiration. You can see the full product range and make sure you ask your tradie for Australian made. Right.